We have checked into the hotel. We'll have a closer look at that later. The first thing you do when you go into the hotel is a bit of a jaw dropper. It is very nice indeed. Not seeing the rooms yet. Like I said, we'll, we'll, uh, I'll show you around. I'll take you on this little trip with me. Uh, first thing you do when you stand on this practice screen is uh, a bit of a wow as well, because uh, as you can see, that's not a bad backdrop. Um, Lagomera in the background there. There's a little island with a golf course on it. I'd like to do that trip. Abama Golf Course is pretty much five star. Played it a few months back, but I'm going to take you on a little bit of a nine-hole vlog this time round. See how the average golfer fares. And um, greens are like absolute lightning. I'm stood on the practice putting green, and getting on the green is one thing. Getting a ball on the hole is a totally different story. So anyway, I'll get to the first tee, and uh, let's see how we get on. It's almost gone in. I don't know whether it's a deceiving, but I, it, I was, and it's pure luck because I ended up uh, front left, and what I didn't know, there's a quite severe cam because the ball has just drifted in from left all the way down to the hole. start to around a, a tapping birdie you know what that means downhill from here <laughs> That's as good as I've got with a G400 Max. Well, once again, that's my Sunday best. That's a driver and three wood. Uh, that was a G410 three wood as well. Still got that hard sound, but it doesn't half perform, you know. The kind of golf shop we all love. Flick one up in the air, tight lie, or knife it through the back. A yard if you look I don't know about 50 yards something like that I think I don't want to be short either let's go oh my word I'm having a bit of a day here that's right on it I'm just going to try and show you this because so far first two holes are slopes on these greens and they're severe have probably helped me I've had a kick in on both nearer to the hole on this, I think the opposite's happened. It's gone, I think that was close to the flag. It cleared the bunker by more than that, but I think it's gone back down. And if you get down lower, I don't know what you can see the fall off, but this is, again, you probably can't pick it up in the light, but if you pan across there, look out of your way. The greens, seriously, are tough. Take that, really happy. I had a feeling uh, if I didn't sit that hard enough, I could see that rolling straight back towards me. But a bit of a start here at Obama.
by Gunstock and Chat on that last hole and uh, this is what Abama is all about to be fair. I hit probably the best drive I've hit this morning. I hit a really good wedge in over the flag but that putt was like lightning. I knew as soon as I did it it was gone but I didn't expect it to roll off the green and my buggy was uh, 30 yards away so I didn't get wedged. Anyway, walked off with a double bogey. But the greens are like glass and if you're on the wrong side of them, well good luck as you can see. Next hole coming up is hole, what are we on? Is it six? Six or seven? Every hole is great here though, isn't it, to be fair? Gone in. I thought I was going in, that's finished right at the back of the hole. Wow. I've had two tapping birdies, which is uh, unusual. I don't know how much you can pick up the camera from that. It was about 77 yard uh, wedge in. And uh, the, the bit of luck I've had is obviously I, I don't know the camber of the greens that well. But obviously that swung in from the right hand side and uh, in my favour. Um, but yeah, a little bit lucky, but you, you would need to know the cameras on these greens to score well. But as it happens, it's worked out in my favour. Another birdie. certainly didn't help me there about leaving a flag in I can't believe how that stayed out to be honest with you it looked uh, I don't know how you've seen again how severe the slope was railroaded up the hill straight in the middle of the flag and I expected that one to just drop in but uh, it didn't do it but happy to take a three because like I said huge uh, huge steep drop off right in front of that uh, in front of that flag Right, as you can see, drive pulled it down the left. It hit it a fair old way to be fair, but just pulled it, no cut on it whatsoever, and uh, lucky to stay outside of the water. But I've got a good five iron back into play and took the water out of the equation, so let's see if we get this one close. Another tapping birdie would be good. Do you know what? It's not a tapping birdie, but it's not bad at the minute. I don't know what's going on, and uh, that's another chance for a decent birdie, about four foot by the looks of it. You don't get many chances for birdie easier than that and uh, just drifted away on 40 but uh take a par i suppose still putting a half decent nine holes together but what do you reckon of a bammer comments down below at this point it's uh some pretty decent holes i was here in october and this green was being dug up and relayed so i can't believe how this thing's looking already but uh it's a decent track it's a good test as well i think it's one of them where if you're hitting the ball okay maybe you can score around here greens are really tough but it's immaculate in terms of its condition but like i said interest in your opinion what you've seen so far stick some comments down below and uh, let me know what you're thinking
So bogey to finish, nine holes at Obama. Uh, I don't know what the score was, to be honest with you. I know we had a couple of birdies, a few bogeys in there, but to be fair, that was a pretty decent knock. More than happy with that round here, because I could imagine you can uh, rack up a bit of a score. But yeah, it worked out okay for me today. Like I said on the previous clips, let me know what you think of Obama. Um, also, let me think, let me know what you thought of that accommodation that I showed you earlier as well. It's uh, pretty impressive stuff, those apartments as well. So uh, all in all, it's been uh, a great day. Thanks to Obama for having the average golfer here. I'm gonna try tomorrow morning, I'll film another nine hole vlog or something similar to show you a little bit more out of this back nine. But I uh, hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Probably not. And uh, I'll catch you all soon.